Hello everybody, Dr. Ski Scars here with another video for ya. Part 3 of 6 of the Zombies Buried gameplay. Pick up the avatar in that mystery box. And on the last part I said I was going to be explaining why I had so many ponies on my channel. In the last video I told you that I was a pony, but that's not exactly why, so... Let's get started on the specifics here of why, so... Every pony has their own specific, um type of a role in my channel they all do their own thing for example Twilight she organizes my videos files and everything that's with my channel she also is the one who keeps me updated when I need to post a new video like seriously if I go more than a week and a half without posting a video I'll get this from her <laughs> yeah she is a great reminder and without her there will be no organization at all now Rarity and Pinkie Pie they help me with the channel art and the channel decor Although there wasn't really much to do, they did make about 12 different channel art concepts and it finally came down to the one that I have now. Applejack and Rainbow Dash, AJ and RD helped me out with getting clips from my montages. Funny story about the most recent montage, Montage of Fun number 5, Applejack and Rainbow came to me asking who I thought was a better sniper. And you know, I couldn't choose, so I said, okay guys, I have an idea here. I'm going to have you get a bunch of clips of snipers on Black Ops 2, and I'll put them in my next montage. So that's why I had Applejack's theme from Finding His Magic play for the first part, and Rainbow Dash's theme for the second, because the first part was Rainbow Applejack's clip, sorry, and the second was Rainbow's clips. After that, we all came to the decision that it was a tie between them both, and they of course agreed with it, but I'm sure they'll challenge each other in something else in, in the time being. Now, Fluttershy, she kind of helps every pony out with whatever they do. She doesn't really have her own specific job. I mean, sometimes she's helping Twilight, sometimes she's helping Rarity and Pinkie Pie, sometimes she's helping me. I mean, but she doesn't really have a specific job, so. But her contributions are just as valuable as every pony else. She's really a great help around. Sometimes she gives moral support for my videos and whatnot. Now for Octavia, Vinyl Scratch, and Dr. DJ Vinyl. Octavia and Vinyl help me find songs for my videos and montages. Octavia helps choose a song for my intro and outro, and Vinyl mainly helps with the montage songs. Which explains why there is a montage named after her bass cannon. You know, Dr. DJ Vinyl, my OC, helps out with editing and commentaries and montages. He also moderates my channel, and my Twitter account, and my Facebook account. Think if it was my co-admin. He helps out with everything that is, um... Of the higher management, if you will. Now, there's one thing that every pony does, which I'm sure you all notice, is that they'll post comments for me, and you'll know who is posting them when they sign them with their name. You can see an example in the screenshot here that I took. So, that explains the ponies. Now you can rest your minds. If you have any questions for them or about them, just put them in the comments and I'll answer them as soon as I see them. And it looks like we're time traveling yet again. And I hear a song playing now. Hmm. Alright guys, so now that I've explained my name and explained my ponies... I guess I can, um, start going into a bit earlier my beliefs on the, the ending to the zombie story as I check the bank here, take some money and put some in. <clears throat> so... I, um... My f good friend of mine, you all may know him, I Lucky Asura, sent me a link to a video. And that link was the um, ending to the buried Easter egg. Not the buried Easter egg, sorry, the, um, the um, Origins Easter egg. And so I watched it. And let me tell you, I was pissed right the F off. Cause that had to have been the most laziest ending to a to, mo to the most one of the most convoluted and complicated stories I've ever seen. Anyone wanna help an old man down and I just thought really this is all that you come up with? After two call after two years Actually, three years. 
from World at War, Black Ops 1, and Black Ops 2, that's the ending that you come up with? Really? That's all you could think of? That's kind of pathetic. And I just... I mean, after, after putting so much time into learning so many different elements of the story, learning about 115, learning about all the characters, learning about how the zombies came to be and all the secrets and stuff, and doing all these Easter eggs that were so complicated that always turned up wrong, I was disappointed. I mean, they're both... It, it, none, of it, none of it ever happened. It's just two kids just playing a game and that's that that it's just like they pulled it out of their ass and gave it to us I mean don't get me wrong it's a good ending but it's a lazy ending. they could have come up with something a lot more a lot more better than that and at the end of the day I still don't know what my original characters are doing on the moon I mean, on, I never played the, or the Origins Easter Egg. I don't know if it ever explains that, but I'm still kind of questioning, okay, so... What the hell are the original characters doing on the moon? Do they ever get back to Earth? I mean, I just... I'm just disappointed here. I was expecting a, a something bigger. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I thought maybe... The original characters come back from the moon. They'd meet up with the, um with the new four characters and the original characters explain what's going on to them what the hell and do you want with my money, I, I don't really know I mean I was I, I just wasn't expecting what they gave us that that was it was just lazy and there was no effort put into it I, what really gets me is how do two kids think of a complicated story like this just how I mean just think about it two kids at their age let's say that they were between the ages of say let's say seven and maybe ten they didn't look that old they, they thought of a story that this complicated this complex that had so many twists and turns and double meanings to everything and just makes you think how so, I mean I don't know what you guys thought about it I mean if you can you can leave your own uh, thoughts about it in the, in the um in the comments down there and we can just go from there I guess I mean but in my opinion to sum it all up it, it was a good ending trust me it was a good ending to it but it was kind of disappointing and a bit lazy, in my opinion. That's how I saw it. So, you can give me your own thoughts in the comments down there. And we can go off of that. Um, so. Let's continue with the zombies here. I can't really taste much of anything. So in the next video, I guess since I already explained how I um, feel about the zombies, another thing I could talk about in the next video for part four is I will talk about some future projects of mine and maybe some changes to the channel that I plan on doing. So that's something. We can go from there. All right, gonna go inside this mansion here. Old lady, die, die. Thank you. Open up the bookcase. Oh gosh! All right. Oh yeah, another one. Back off! Come on, let me get through here. All right, here we go. Got through. Got through. Oh, another. Oh god, move. Uh. All right, here we go. Got through. Are they gonna follow me out? Doesn't look like. Okay, there we go. Oh well. Okay, we're good. In the maze, in the maze, in the maze. Checking that scoreboard. Zombies is spawning in the map. Mm -hmm. 
Let's go up here with, with the buddies. Whoa. Is that a glitch or something? Excuse me. I thought I saw like a body of a zombie pop up in front of me. It was weird. Alright. Man, this AN-94. You just don't see the end of it. Online, now with zombies. Just everywhere. It just follows you. Alrighty then. Was that... Okay. Thought I saw something again, but I guess that was just me. Jumping over the holes. Jumping over the holes. Let's upgrade their gun. Shooting lasers now. The little 115 lasers. Oh god, the zombies are coming. Here we go. Things are starting to pick up here. It looks like this video is starting to come to a close. What's going to happen? Are we going to finish it? Uh, we're getting hit all over the place. We're trapped on the stairs. Oh no, Falcon goes down. I got you. Quick revive for the win. Get up. Uh, they're all around us. They're waiting for us. Everyone goes down but me. There's one more zombie left. Or there are a few more left, but they got him for me. Good. Alright, he's down there, down. Alright, looking good. Looking good. Start to quiet down a bit. And looks like this video here is coming to an end once I kill this last zombie. I will see you guys in part four to talk about future projects. See you in the next video.